What's going on, guys? Uh, before we start, I just want to preface this by saying that this is in no way or means me uh, looking for sympathy or going to complain. This is more of an update um, on some things that have been going on, um, as well as uh, my personal life. Uh, there's no trouble. There's no drama. Don't worry about it. Uh, this is just me talking about uh, some things behind the scenes that I haven't really been talking to you guys about, as well as um, just kind of having a communication, as well as there, why there's a, re a reason for there being a lack of content on the channel. Um, I uploaded a video about two, three weeks ago, uh, just breaking down the... Uh, what you call it, the new seasonal trailer and all that, breaking down everything for season 13. And I just went cold turkey. I've been cold turkey on this channel for a while. Um, I've been really, really lax on content as well as uh, networking and uh, hanging out in my friends' streams. Um, so first I'm going to talk about what's been going on. And then we're going to talk about uh, where I'm going to go from here. Uh, content's still going to be going. Don't worry about it. Uh, this is just a heart-to-heart. -heart. I'm just telling you guys some of the stuff that's been going on. Uh, so for those of you that uh, know, I recently got out of the military. Uh, I proudly served four years in the Air Force. I got uh, a sword. Uh, with you guys knowing my name, you guys will probably see it whenever, if you guys ever donate. Uh, but this is my going away gift from the 11th Space Warning Squadron uh, of the United States Air Force, or, uh, which has transitioned over to uh, the United States Space Force. Uh, I served as a uh, space systems operator, um, and it was the proudest job of my life proudest proudest thing i've ever done um but i separated um and a lot of people uh would hear me talk about how uh this was my dream i wanted to pursue it as much as i could uh and then i separated um i've talked about this quite a few times um but for those of you to get a little uh a little bit of a refresh um, I was accused of, uh, due to my dark sense of humor, uh, I was accused of wanting to bring weapons into work and kill people, uh, my fellow service members. Um, and that hit me hard. I was already dealing with uh, depression and anxiety, uh, really severe depressive uh, symptoms uh, due to still lingering from my parents' uh, nasty breakup. Um, in which I was, both sides of my family were trying to get me on their side, so I became a bit of a recluse. Um, and having that happen after I came back from a vacation that I hadn't had in 13 years, um, and being a smack dab in the middle of trouble again, uh, that was no way, well, partly my fault. I have a dark sense of humor, but so does everyone in the military. Um, but due to uh, sharing dark sense of humor with others and that going uh, and being shared with others that did not share that same sense of humor, uh, I was accused of wanting to kill people. Um, and I was basically interrogated by uh, what is the equivalent of uh, the FBI in the military called the Office of Special Investigations or OSI. Um, that caused me to take my depression to the worst and I truly became... A recluse in every sense of the word. I spent all my every waking moment on Twitch. Uh, they had me uh, separate uh, from my job, uh, back shop, back shop, back shop, because I just could not find. I had no will to go on. This was my dream, and it was being torn apart right in front of me. Um, and I let did not uh, keep up with my fitness. Um, as I should have, and because of that, I failed to meet standards. I was demoted. 
And uh, because of that, I did not meet what we call high tenure, which means I have to be a certain rank in order to re-enlist. Uh, so I was forced to separate. Um, and dealing with that already was a bunch of uh, issues. I had to rush to find a place to live, uh, all kinds of stuff. Uh, I'm safely in a new apartment now that I love, um, living off of my uh, post-9-11 GI Bill, uh, going to college full-time. Um, but as soon as, even if I'm getting away from the military, there's still that getting away from the military. Uh, I had, whenever I separated, I have, and still feel um, hollow, if it makes sense. Um, it's hard to describe. Whenever you're in the military, you have this iron will, this determination, this pride. You're doing something incredible. You're, you have people depending on you, and you're filled with purpose. When I left the military, all that was gone, and what felt like made me, me. Um, and because of that, I've gotten into uh, some pretty bad habits. Um, I have uh, started drinking more quite regularly. Uh, some I Not enough to get drunk, and I'm quite a heavyweight. Uh, but if I don't control it, I feel like it could go out of hand very, very fast, so I've been take my caution to control that. Uh, I started smoking again. Um, and I'm still holding on to uh, my reclusive habits. I don't talk to anyone. Uh, I barely even talk to my girlfriend. Uh, if she's, if no one's here and like directly talking to me, I don't talk to anyone. I just, I can't. I'm not, Still not ready. And Camry, bless her heart, my girlfriend has been so supportive uh, and has helped me through this. Uh, and I'm thankful for her, but it's still going to take a while. Um, I tried throwing myself into uh, content creation again. Uh, my video, making my video on season 13 was supposed to be be uh, me coming back to YouTube uh, and doing all that and making content and then making my stream, which is where my main focus is, uh, my full-time uh, stream. Um, I started to uh, pick at things. I started to uh, focus on the numbers more. I started to become someone that wasn't me, and that still is something that I'm struggling with. Um, yeah, it's it's something that I'm not. It's something I gotta change. A part of me. I had so many people. Uh, today's stream was fantastic. People were uh, supportive, incredible. I so supportive, and my brain just was nitpicking the negative things, the negative things. I couldn't focus on the happy, and. I'm recognizing it, I'm recognizing the good, and I'm trying to make myself better. Um, and it's something that's going to take a minute. Uh, it, I'm doing a lot of apologizing. Um, I want to recognize a lot of faults um, because I feel like I've let people down um, by letting this come to the forefront in multiple situations, um, and it's something I'm work, working towards. There's a lot that's going to be happening. Um, I barely have any energy. Uh, in the mornings, I'm studying. I have my classes, and then I go <laughs> do butt fuck nothing or until stream starts, and then after stream ends, I do butt fuck nothing again. I just have like, those two are the only things that I'm able to really focus on, um, and I'm happy that I can do that, but I'm not satisfied with where I am, and this kind of sp spawned me wanting to make this video uh, to talk to you guys. Um, so, plans for content going forward. Um, I'm going to try and get back into one video a day, or not <laughs> a day, that's too much, way too much. No, I can't do that. Uh, trying to get back into 
um, doing a video a week. Um, I don't know when those are going to be. I'm not going to impose that limit on me yet. Um, but I'm just going to go for that goal of making one video a week. Uh, whether it be a funny clip compilation or uh, talking about uh, things that uh, new series that I've been talking about for a while, but I just keep putting off and off and off um, is my In the Weeds series, which is a video series, which is going to be um, kind of like more in depth about certain topics that um, newer players don't know about and veteran players could use a reminder of uh, topics uh, going forward. Uh, going to be uh, how to make certain builds, which class uh, prevails at which. Uh, and best damage techniques uh, for boss raids, so on and so forth. Um, maybe if that series says well, I'll invite friends to come over and talk about PvP because that's not my strong suit, although I have been getting into that. Um, but for now, I just want to make one video a week. Uh, there's no... I'm not giving up on the channel. I'm not. This is, it's been, originally, it was something that I wanted to do for, uh, what you call it, uh, to help network and bring more attention to uh, Twitch. And while that is one of the goals for this channel, I want to make content that can solely sit here on YouTube. Uh, stuff that you're not going to see over on my Twitch. Um, and for that, I want to start branching out also away from... Uh, Destiny content as well. Um, Outriders is coming out. I'm going to make a video on that. I'm going to stream it. Um, I'll post the VOD here. Uh, it comes out Thursday. Uh, so I'll be playing that and I'll post the VOD here whenever it's over. Uh, whenever I finish my stream. Uh, so expect that. Um, but there's a lot of stuff coming. And I want to make this a great community. I want this. It's already a great community. But I want it to be even greater. Uh, because you guys have shown me, you all have shown me that we're capable of so much more and I want to tap into that latent potential and allow us, us as a whole, shine absolutely bright because I have no doubt we're one of the best communities on Twitch. No doubt. We may be very, very small, but by God, we're one of the most positive out there. It's one of the number one things I'm always uh, uh, complimented on, and it's something I'm very, very proud of. And Lord knows that I've helped you guys through tough times, um, and you guys have helped me through very tough times. And this is why I'm comfortable coming out and talking to you guys about everything. It's not <laughs> every day you can get some guy to uh, say he's – starting to have a drinking problem, that he's starting to uh, fall into bad habits, that he's letting his health go away, uh, that he's depressed all the time, and that he has bad thoughts all the time. And I want to be a better guy for you guys. So this has been an update. Uh, thank you guys. If you guys watched to the end, uh, thank you. I appreciate it. It means the world to me. And uh, I love you guys. I mean that in every sense of the word. Even if I don't know you or you're just clicking on this link uh, <laughs> because of the title. Uh, clickbaity as it is. Uh, thank you. Thank you. I mean it. Th I thank you and I love you. I don't even know your name. But I love you from the bottom of my heart. Thank you guys. And uh, take care.